What is going on everyone? My name is Eskimo and today I'm going to bring you guys a new Hunger Games map. This is going to be the Pine Forest map which was ported from the PC onto the Xbox by a guy named Todd Hale. He's the same exact guy who sent the last map to me and this one map is I think it's even better in the first because as you can see up here is the spawn area. This is where you guys are going to spawn at and to get to the map you go in there but first I'm going to read off so it was made by Todd Hale, these guys, other guys, those guys help and feel free to add them for the Hunger Games that they said. But pretty much it took them like three weeks to do this map and I think it turned out fantastic because it really does look awesome. But I want to show you guys this uh, spawning system because it's really awesome because um, even if you die in the Hunger Games, you can still sit up there and watch down, like, on the people who are down there. So, I like, if I'm doing the Hunger Games, I won't have to kick the people who are, over, who I killed or whatever. But, okay, so here we are in the area. And you go down each little hallway and you reach one of the little pods. So here I am, I'm going to go through this place right here. And there's the host room right in there, so let's see. Okay, so we're going to go inside the host room right now, and so pretty much to pull to activate the pods, and uh, then the piston will push up, and you pretty much get released, so there's no timer, so there's no lag between the pods, so I like this map a whole lot better because there's going to be a whole lot less lag than there was in the other map because there is no timer, so yeah, and there's other stuff in here, so like... uh things for like the middle chest so like if you want to reset or whatever host wants to reset but there's also uh, here's the rules inside of here don't break blocks besides leaves and mushrooms you're supposed to stay inside of their arena so you don't break the glass wall around the entire map and the final rule is kill your opponents to win so pretty much outlast your opponents the best to the best of your abilities guys and uh, there's a lot of cool stuff around this map like as you can see there's chests like scattered around the map and uh, there's a lot of obstacles I really like this map because of the, the because of the obstacles uh, look at me failing already but pretty much uh, there, there is a lot of obstacles like I said you know hidden chests around the map and there are also traps around the map I want to see if I can find one but yeah there's a lot of traps here's a castle over here and overall uh, I think there are three crafting tables so, you know, if uh, someone is cheats by stealing the crafting table in the middle or whatever, you can still win because there are three <laughs> You can still craft stuff because there are three crafting tables on the map because I had that happen to me in the Hunger Games once before. But they actually did add some of their own additions on this map. Like, uh, they did add some stuff. Like, I know they added a ship over here. Like, as you can see uh, inside it, here's a ship, and they added that themselves. So, I think it's cool that they ported it, but they also added some some of, like, their own little touch. You could, you know, call this map sort of their own. And also, uh, the middle here, it, it, look, it looks sick if somebody lights it up in the middle of the night. But, yeah, guys, if you want to participate in Hunger Games with me, be sure to follow me on Twitter. I'll definitely be hosting some Hunger Games on this map probably really soon, actually. So, follow me on Twitter at LilBabyEskimo. And also, if you want to add these guys to play the Hunger Games, I'll leave. Feel free to pause the video right now to check out their names. But this map is definitely sick. It's just insane, and I love it. So as you can see, there are some traps on this map. Like, ooh, there's a chest in there. Can I get it? No, I fell on lava. <laughs> but it, it really is a sick map, and I think you guys will love this map. So definitely a big shout out to these guys for submitting it to me. And if you guys have some Hunger Games maps that you'd like to submit to me, or just regular maps in general, then feel free to submit them. I'll check them out because I love seeing like this. And I love putting your guys' creations on YouTube because otherwise some of you guys might not get the chance. I just want to be that guy who helps you guys out. That's who I am. But definitely, guys, uh, be sure to follow me on Twitter, like I said. And also, the download link to this map will be in the description. And also, I will be linking a video telling you how to get the map on your Xbox. It's really not that simple. You just have to download a program called Horizon. And once you do that, you have to, co you have to move your... Um, 
profile on your Xbox onto a little portable USB drive, hard drive, whatever you want to, whatever you guys want to use, then you just copy the profile IDs and onto uh, the save file for the map, and it's really simple. You just rehash, resign, whatever, <laughs> whatever the program Horizon does, and it's it, it's really not that difficult. It's really simple to do, and and you can start playing the Hunger Games on your own. So definitely look out for future Hunger Games for me, especially a lot more because I'm thinking I want to play this map a whole lot more now that I am actually uh, got this map because it just looks insane I love it way more than the first map because like right here there's a lot of obstacles you have to move around trees and the other map is really cool because it does have a lot of cities or it's in a city but I like this one better because you like you know somebody can come from anywhere anytime besides you just seeing somebody at the end of the street and you have a showdown with them but yeah guys I've been Eskimo and I will see you guys next time so if you enjoyed this video be sure to leave a like and comment or favorite all that wonderful stuff and yeah guys I will see you all next time